Hey, Dolphins, John Kinjemi here. We'll continue to look back at the Dolphins' Super Bowl wins with a second championship following the perfect 72 season. Plus, take a look ahead at Sunday's Super Bowl 51 matchup, all right here on Dolphins Daily, presented by Aquafina. Hey, keep fun, keep fun. After completing the perfect 72 season, the Miami Dolphins would find themselves back in the Super Bowl the next year. January 13, 1974, that was the date when the Dolphins completed back-to-back Super Bowls, handing the Minnesota Vikings a 24-7 loss. The Dolphins were led by Super Bowl MVP Larry Zonka, who rushed for 145 yards on 33 carries and two touchdowns. Defensively, the Dolphins were stingy on that cold January afternoon, forcing two turnovers and chasing down the elusive Vikings quarterback Fran Tarkington for two sacks. As we turn our attention to Super Bowl 51 this Sunday, those who will be watching should expect a close game. Of the six Super Bowls that New England has played in, win or lose, the average score has been three points. The Falcons defense has allowed 25 points per game this season, second most of any team to reach the Super Bowl. But the Falcons can also score points. 56% of Atlanta's drives have resulted in a field goal or a touchdown, which is the second best percentage this century. Lastly, if you're wondering how much those crazy and entertaining commercials cost during a break in the game, just one of those commercials, 30 second spot, that'll cost you $5 million. Well, that's all I have for you guys today. Enjoy Super Bowl Sunday, and we'll see you back here on Monday on Dolphins Daily, presented by Aquafina.